Welcome to Flavor Bound Beer Bites. Today we're reviewing, reviewing uh, Double Daisy Cutter. <laughs> it was released yesterday, so it is super, super fresh. Super excited to review this beer. Uh, this one we kind of decided to do a little bit impromptu. And I uh, hope you guys like the format. Let us know if you want us to do more of these. Uh, it's definitely our intention to review more beers, uh, mostly after the review episodes of the books we do. Sure. But I'd like to do a lot more of these just short form beer reviews. So let us know what you think. And uh, at that, let's get into the beer. So this is uh, Double Daisy Cutter from Half Acre Beer Company. We like uh, Half Acre Beer. We love Half Acre. We love Half Acre Beer. Yeah. Um, it's an 8% alcohol beer. It is, uh, there's no rating on the IBUs that I could find. Uh, I think it was twelve ninety nine for the for the beer. It's 22 ounces. So let's get into the appearance, yeah? The appearance. I like, I like the label. It's a pretty we awesome got, label. We got a double-headed donkey with, you know, I, I can't tell what he's carrying on his back, but. Well, he's got a sombrero on. and He he's, got it, he got two, he got a sombrero and doble cortador. Is is the is the ribbon that's on the on the label, and but, there's like a like a a zeppelin that's got a daisy with the eyes yeah. cut out. So it's a, it's a play off of the original daisy cutter daisy uh, cutter label. Daisy cutter being one of their uh, primaries. Their, their it is their standard. It's yeah, their flagship beer. Yeah, but uh, double daisy cutter is uh, as they put it. A little bit, they flex their muscles in certain ways and then use some restraint in some other ways. I've never had this beer, so I'm super excited to try it. But if you look at the, if you look at the label, very cool. Um, it, it, it's very hard, uh, and obviously I can't show it on the camera, but it's almost like hologramish, where you've got the uh, DDC in the diamonds and then it's got the two donkeys. I didn't even notice that. Yeah, very cool. It's, it's actually, awesome. it's, it's very cool. Um, it's a beautiful label. I, I wish I could. I wish I could show you this more, but we'll I'm, get it in there. We'll get it in there. All right. So the appearance on the beer. It's golden, slight haze could be just refrigerator haze. I don't think it's hop haze. No. Very clear. I like. Um, Glasses are a little. No sediment to speak of whatsoever. No. Um, nice white head. Yeah. Beautiful. Good looking beer. Good looking beer. Take uh, a. The aroma. Wow. Oh. <laughs> that's, that's, just, that's just pretty. Yeah, so it's got like, it's got some floral yeah. tones in there. It's a, lot like, of, a lot of floral. And, 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 and it's more than, than the original uh, Daisy Cutter. It's, rem it's reminiscent of that, but it's definitely amplified. Definitely. I, 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 oh, that's just... Oh, wow. Oh, you get that citrus in the, Yeah, there's definitely oh. some like citrus poking through. But like floral and like oh man, wow that's great just... smelling beer. God, that just smells unbelievable. Nasrovia. Nasrovia. Wow, that's incredible. You know, I gotta say that makes me smile. <laughs> that's absolutely freaking insane. That... It's go ahead. I I'm. I'm I'm at a loss for words right now. Actually, it's uh, it's definitely got it's def it's reminiscent in the flavor, uh, just like a regular Daisy Cutter, but again amplified. But it's not crazy. The bitterness doesn't beat you over the head. Uh, you get the citrus. There's some bitterness. You know, it's a it's a double. You know, it's amped up. But it's. Well, I gotta tell you, I, I in my opinion, like this is, this is so much more smooth than, than Daisy. Daisy? Yeah. I wish I had a regular, you should have had a Daisy next Just a, to, yeah. next to go side by side. Unbelievable. Smooth. It's citrus. super well balanced. Oh, the balance on this is, is unbelievable. I don't think it has the biscuity finish that Daisy Cutter typically has. Definitely not. But there's definitely a bigger malt backbone to balance out the, the extra hop in there. This is world class stuff. This is fantastic. So, I'll take another. You know, it's, it's funny. It's funny you say that. You get the you get that little bit of malty on the on the finish of it. Yeah, just a touch. Not not overpowering, not overbearing. Um, even the even the the hop is just it's so well balanced. I'm I'm floored by this. This actually. yeah, I, the the beer I immediately want to um, compare it to is Dreadnought by Three Floyds. Um, it's that beer is kind of 
really out there. That's what they do. They make their beers pretty extreme. Yeah. Um, this one shows restraint. Um, the bitterness is in check. Everything just so well balanced. Great stuff. Great you stuff, know, guys. And they're supposed to be uh, a, a double. I, I don't get that at all. It doesn't it's drink like one, even. but you know, it's, you know it's special. But it doesn't drink. It doesn't yeah. drink hard. Half acre. Great job. Cheers, guys. Cheers, guys. Unbelievable. So uh, if we had to get a rating, four out of five. Let's just say. I'm going six. <laughs> I would. I would. Seriously. I, I mean, this. And I. And I mean. And I don't mean that jokingly. This is. This is. World class IPA territory. Yeah. For sure. I, I mean, I. Again, lost for words. Lost for words here. It, um. I expect it to be very bitter. I expect it to be truly hoppy and, and whatever, but it's not at all. And just absolutely world class right here. Yeah. I love it. I love it. Yeah. I give it a, I have to give it a six too. I'm, it's pretty stellar. Yeah. All right, guys. So this was our review of uh, Double Daisy Cutter by Half Acre Brewery out of Chicago. Uh, this one is out now, very limited. So if you're in the Chicago area, get your hands on it now. Try and find it now. Yeah. Um, the days that pass as, as this video uh, is being edited. <laughs> uh, good luck to you. I'll try to get this up as soon as possible, guys. So yeah. thanks for watching. Cheers.